Hi there, I am going to be solving today's New York Times crossword puzzle. So this is Tuesday, August 18th, 2020, and I'm going to speak my thoughts out loud as I solve this. If you'd like to follow along, you should see the clues toward the top of the screen in red. Okay, let's solve a Tuesday puzzle. Piece of Leonton Price. I have no idea what that means. Piece of? No, piece for. Still have no idea what that means. Something produced by a dogwood tree or a dog. Huh. Oh, bark. That's a really cute clue. I like that. Um, sealed with a kiss. Okay, mine. That's amwa. Good. Um, a choir might sing in it. I feel like unison. Yeah, that's that's what it was. All right, cul-de-sac. Okay, so far so good. Alanis Morissette song about unfortunate situations. Ironic. Good, good clue. Uh, blank Quimby of children's literature. I don't know. I don't know this person. Simple adding device is an abacus. Okay. Piece four is an aria, I suppose, is my, is my guess. That's the kind of piece that's being talked about. Ramona looks like the best name. Ramona Quimby actually does sound mildly familiar. Nice opening section with Abacus, Ramona, and Ironic and, and good clues so far. Okay, our first theme entry, what 53 across changed? So 53 across looks like it might be the last theme entry. Uh, I don't, I, you know, I just don't have enough letters to see this yet. Not without a clue. Coin in an arcade is a token. Good. Okay, uh, Keenan and Kel, great. Scottish Miss is a lass. So far, so good. One reason dogs lick us is for this, it's believed. Huh. I'm not sure. Love? I don't know. Why do dogs lick us? Recipe measures. Teaspoons, probably? Um, division of the economy. A sector. Yep. Zeus. God. Son? No. Zeus isn't anyone's son, is he? Toyota hybrid. Prius. I guess it is sun. I don't really know my mythology, I apologize. Um, I think this is the article. And then what's going on? Blue moons are rare. One reason dogs lick us. What is it? I'm still not seeing it. Okay, some gym personnel are trainers. Yep, that checks out. Rights advocate who campaign. Oh, okay, so we have another themer up here. Rights advocate who campaigned for 53 across. Okay, so constitution I'm seeing. So something changed. Constitution. Oops. So the constitution changed. This looks like an Alice. Oh, they lick us for salt? That's very interesting. Good trivia clue and uh, kind of gross. Very interesting. Defaulter's loss informally. Is that a repo? Like, um, yeah. Hmm something play. I feel like I should see that. That's got to be Eel. Lucy who played Watson. That's Lucy Lou. Uh, the Erie Canal. I haven't seen Elementary, but people recommend it to me. And then rule, Role Play. Not Rule Play. Role Play, yes. Alice Paul. I should... Okay, let's see. Orange. Citrus drink often sold in a pear-shaped bottle. That's Orangina. Good entry, and I like I like Orangina a lot. The beverage and the entry. One measure of economic activity. It's either GDP or GNP. GDP is better for the clue, and GNP is better for filling crosswords. So uh, not really sure which one to to guess. Pele. We're all born naked, and the rest is could be drag. That's an interesting quote, and then it would be GDP. Call it a day is retire. Compulsively particular is anal. Sour is tart. No resistance today. No resistance today. It's good. Uh, moon goddess is probably Luna, right? Front of a pig is a snout. What's going on here? Subject of 53 across. Women's suffrage. Great. Okay, so this is a women's suffrage. Um, themed puzzle. So what is 53 across going to be then? Is it the name of the act that changed the constitution? The name of the amendment? Uh, I wonder if I'm supposed to already know what the revealer is going to be. Okay. Some partners in lesbian couples. Um, is this femmes? 
It might be. I'm not sure though. Surfer's Need is a wave, good. Grad is an alum. Okay, heroin in Pearl Bucks the Good Earth. Not sure. Tonsillite is treating Doc. Is an ENT, right? Good. Okay, what's this? Seven Sisters School in the Hudson Valley is Vassar. All right, Ford Motor Muscle Cars are Mustangs. Good. OMG. Gasp, maybe? Um, kids game with a lot of running. Tag. Period in history is an era. Argo. Pre-Q Quartet. Oh, is this just like, um, uh, M-N-O-P? Like L-M-N-O-P-Q? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right. 36th state to ratify 53 across, resulting in its passage. Interesting. Tennessee. All right. And then ending with chick. Okay, so what's this going to be? Measure fully ratified. So amendment, it's the number of the amendment. Oh my gosh, I should definitely know this. How, uh... Is it an amendment? Am I, am I sure about that, though? Chickadee, yeah. Expected as a baby is due, okay. Totals is runs up. Runs two, no, no, runs two. Bullring cries are olays. Let me just crush this section real quick. Grumpy Cat, that's it, those are memes. Fill in worker. Fill in worker is a temp. And this is gonna be the car, the flop. Indeed. All right, so amendment, um, oh my gosh, which amendment is it? What's strange to me is that it's only three letters. Oh, so it's maybe gonna be given in Roman numerals? Cause I feel like it's not one of the first 10 amendments. And that means that, uh, cause the first 10 amendments is the Bill of Rights. Uh, I hope I'm not like revealing my total ignorance here, but the first bill, bill, 10 amendments is the Bill of Rights. There is no three letter number um, below 10, uh, greater than 10, which makes me think that this is gonna be Roman numerals um, because I don't believe that women's suffrage was in the Bill of Rights. Um, certain about it. If blank doesn't make us better, then what on earth is it for? Gotta be art. I've been reading some Alice Walker recently. A uh, foldable bed is a futon. And then what's this? Without the possibility of being taken back for keeps. I really like that entry. Balkan land whose capital is Pristina. Kosovo. Good. Bra part. Strap. Hey you. Psst. Good. That's Anne of Green Gables. I'm just going to get these from crosses. I think this is Ria's. Let's just get this good one. Computer key usually hit with the left pinky. That's escape. And then what do we have here? What juice cleanses are supposed to get rid of? Oh no, that's toxin. So I guess it's tab. Yeah, tab. That also works. Um, avians. And it is it is a uh, Roman numeral. Avians and a box a box set. Wow. Um, all right. So that was our puzzle. So it was a uh, women's suffrage themed. Um, and this is the 19th amendment, um, which I, I, I knew in the back of my head, but uh, uh, apologies for, for not getting that right away. Um, so this is, this is a good theme for a Tuesday. It's the kind of theme that um, it's not like, it's not based on wordplay or um, it, it's not meant to confuse you. It's more, it's a theme. I mean, it's like, a, it's a topic and you pick uh, entries that are related to that topic. And it's sort of, this is almost a tribute puzzle, even the tribute puzzles, you usually think of them being for a person, um, but this is sort of a tribute to the 19th amendment as, as a puzzle. Um, and and I, I think it's um, obviously a very worthy tribute puzzle, um, especially in these uh, very charged times we're in. It's, um, it's good to celebrate women's suffrage. Uh, so I'm a fan of this puzzle and um, let's see. We had a lot of themers in here. Alice Paul, Constitution, Women's Suffrage, 19th Amendment, and Tennessee. Tennessee maybe feels a little random among these themers, um, but I guess the fact that uh, it actually resulted in the ratification does make it um, pretty relevant. So uh, I'm curious how Tennessee joined the group here. I wonder if um, 
if Olivia wanted to include the name of one um, notable suffragette and then uh, had to find some entry to balance it out symmetrically and uh, after after some thought Tennessee came to her um, or maybe Tennessee is is just you know super important to this story and uh, and was in the original theme set I'm not sure but um, I, I, I like the theme um, you know it didn't really trip me up because this theme wasn't really meant to trip somebody up or have an aha moment even it's just it's a tribute puzzle um, and and a worthy one at that uh, let's see. I also I liked the bonus fill in this puzzle. I especially like for keeps, just because I don't know. It's I, I like very modern colloquial stuff in my puzzles, and that's the kind of thing that um, people say to one another. You know, it's not in a dictionary, but you know, humans humans say this. Um, I also like Orangina partly because I I like Orangina, um, and and Mustangs is also a good bonus entry. Uh, we also had um, given you know that, that there were wasn't a ton of extra long stuff in addition to those. Um, these sections are. Are nicely filled with Abacus, Ramona, and Ironic up here, and then um, Toxins, Avians, Box Set, and Kosovo. It's a nice little section down here, so uh, a, w a well filled puzzle. Looking around, I think I noticed there was a um, pretty good like representation of women in general in this puzzle. I, I, I thought, um, um, looking around, but like I guess with Ramona and we have Luna. Um, at first I thought that maybe it, 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 it was uh, that there weren't any men in the puzzle whatsoever, but then I saw that we have Kel and, and Pele in the puzzle, so that's not true. Um, but it does, it does seem to be maybe more representative than uh, your typical crossword is these days. And that's even not just in the entries, but in the clues themselves, you know, art, uh, incorporating Alice Walker, and um, you know, we have Pearl Buck over here. Yeah, and um, oh, and and I I read this clue a little too quickly. I I noticed um, that today is August eighteenth, so this is this is not just um, a random day to honor women's suffrage. This is the uh, hundred year anniversary of of the Nineteenth Amendment. So um, definitely a a good a good reason for a tribute puzzle. I also liked a lot of the cluing on this one. Uh, it was. It was an easy puzzle, but um, Tuesdays are supposed to be. Uh, I enjoyed the clue on bark just because it was cute. Um, just a cute way to like, I don't know, dogwood tree and dog both bark. That's a nice, nice way to um, relate these two things. And uh, salt, you know, I'm not usually, uh, trivia clues usually aren't my favorites, although I like learning things from crossword puzzles, but sometimes trivia clues are just too trivia related or they're hard to like suss out on your own. But this is a really good version of it. One, because it's actually gettable and it's kind of gross and, um, and it's genuinely interesting. So uh, those two clues stood out to me. So those were my thoughts on this puzzle, uh, and I'm curious to hear what your thoughts were. I know that Olivia occasionally um, tunes into these, so Olivia, I hope you're watching, and um, thank you very much for the entertainment and for the tribute puzzle. And uh, to the rest of you, I will see you tomorrow. I make these every Monday through Thursday for the New York Times. If you want to keep in touch, then um, clicking the red subscribe button below the video is the best way to do that. And uh, thank you so much for watching.